through the Seeger Collaborative uh, Consortium, they are looking in their uh, first clinical trial at eosinophilic esophagitis, eosinophilic gastritis, gastroenteritis, and colitis. And that information is available on the APFED website. Patients with rare eosinophilic diseases, such as hypereosinophilic syndrome, eosinophilic fasciitis, some of those rare eosinophilic diseases, can also participate by registering in the EOS Connect registry. Information about that is available on the APFED webpage. When you take individuals who have what seems to be an isolated case of an incredibly rare disease, and you're able to put multiple individuals in a registry with the same disease, you can then begin starting to ask that group questions through surveys, through review of their medical records that will help us answer questions about even the rarest of these diseases.